Today I'm going to be demonstrating the difference between rendering with CPU and GPU compute in Blender. And for this video I've got a far more complex scene that I'm going to be loading. It's the BMW Blender test. So it's a much more complex scene. I'm going to start off with the CPU rendering first. And I'm just going to go into performance here. It auto detects the system to have 12 threads. So when it comes to dividing the image up, it's very important when rendering with a CPU to divide the image up into as many blocks or tiles as is reasonably possible because each tile has a thread associated with it. So when it comes to the end of the rendering, the more tiles you have, the more effective use the CPU can make of its threads. So I'm going to start the rendering. And you can see the first set of blocks, there are 12 blocks because the CPU is 12 threads. And I must say, this is a pretty awesome model. Okay, almost done. Okay, one thread left. Okay, and this frame rendered in 1 minute and 56 seconds and 74 split seconds. So I'm now going to set the system up to render using GPU compute. And for the first rendering, I'm going to carry the rendering out using the same divisions when it came to the blocks used for the CPU rendering. Okay, user preferences. I'm just going to set the system up to make use of CUDA. And start the rendering. And immediately you can see that the GPU renders each block much more quickly than the CPU does. However, in the next rendering, I'm going to show you something rather interesting. And this is because I'm not actually making effective use of the GPU's capability at this point. Okay, and that frame rendered in 50 seconds and 24 split seconds. Okay, I'm going to see if I can improve the rendering time. I'm now going to render the image as a single tile. Okay. Okay, it's now set to render as a single tile. So let's see how it goes now.
Okay, and that frame rendered in 21 seconds and 44 split seconds. So it's rather interesting to note that with a CPU, you want to divide the image up into as many tiles as reasonably possible. And when it comes to a GPU, you want to render the image as a single tile. And as far as I can tell you, you make far more effective use of the CUDA cores when you render the image as a single tile rather than dividing it up. Just for your reference, the CPU used for the rendering was the Intel i7-980X, the GPU was the NVIDIA GTX Titan X, the version of Windows running on the machine is Windows 8.1, and the version of Blender used was version 2.79. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video.